The Orbiting Astronomical Observatory 2 nicknamed Stargazer was a space observatory launched on December 7, 1968. An Atlas Centaur rocket launched it into a nearly circular 750-kilometre altitude Earth orbit. Data was collected in ultraviolet on many sources including comets, planets, and galaxies. It had two major instrument sets facing in opposite directions, the Smithsonian Astrophysical Observatory and the Wisconsin Experiment Package One discovery was large halos of hydrogen gas around comets, and it also observed Nova Serpentis, which was a nova discovered in 1970. Telescope, Smithsonian Astrophysical Observatory The Smithsonian Astrophysical Observatory, also called Telescope, had four 12-inch Schwarzschild telescopes that fed into uvicons. Various filters, photocathodes, and electronics aided in collecting data in several ultraviolet light passbands. The experiment was completed in April 1970. By the time it finished about 10% of the sky was observed. The Uvicon was an ultraviolet light detector based on the Westinghouse Viticon. Ultraviolet light was converted into electrons which were in turn converted to a voltage as those electrons hit the detection area of the tube. There has been a Uvicon in the collection of the Smithsonian Institute since 1973. Topic. Wisconsin Experiment Package. The Wisconsin Experiment Package had 11 different telescopes for ultraviolet observations. For example, there was a photoelectric photometer fed by a 16-inch telescope with a six-position filter wheel. WEP observed over 1,200 targets in ultraviolet light before the mission ended in early 1973. Topic. Spacecraft bus The observatory was overall about 10 feet by 7 in the shape of an octahedron and it weighed 4,400 pounds. See also Orbiting Astronomical Observatory Orbiting Solar Observatory References Topic. External links OAO-2 Observations of the Alpha Persei Cluster OAO-2 Info and Pics